Let's go! You lousy, no good head shrinker! Oh, come now, Mari. We were making such progress during our sessions. The only mental help that I need is to never be reminded of you again. Such displaced hostility. If you insist on getting angry, why not be psychologically productive and channel it at your so-called friends? I'm done talking with my mouth. Now I talk with my fists! Sorry, but our time is up. <laughs> Don't worry, pal. We'll find her. With the three of us back together, she doesn't stand a chance. It was great! The gang had been reunited and it was all because of me! Even the van ride out of town was like a party! Furry had to pull over twice because he was laughing so hard. But despite all the jokes, I think something had changed. Since childhood, the three of us had never been apart. And our recent isolation gave us all pause for thought. Needless to say, we took a few weeks off before getting back to work. And for the first time in my life, Murray let me drive. Time for a little payback. The Contessa, having escaped us in the prison, is now hiding out in her castle estate. It's a well-fortified, gothic nightmare that would make any thief run in terror. Terrible or not, that's where we're headed. To sweeten the deal, we've learned that the Contessa, who until recently was a secret member of the Claw Gang, is in possession of the Clockwork Eyes. The Thievius Raccoonus describes the eyes stopping opponents dead in their tracks, transfixed in their gaze. It doesn't take a genius to figure out what an accomplished hypnotist could do with such powerful artifacts. News of the Contessa's corruption has spread to Interpol. Constable Neela, being closest to the case, was granted a cash allowance to hire an army of local mercenaries. It looks like we're walking into a full-scale war. But we have to act now, before things go from bad to worse.
Okay, here's the plan. First, take some recon photos around the area. Then make your way up to the re-education tower. Looks... pleasant enough. Oh, and stay clear of tanks. You know, so you don't get blown up into little stinky pieces. Neela's made a headquarters out of that old bank. It's a pretty secure location. It'll take some doing to drive her out. The Contessa has these boats out on patrol against Nayla's army. They could be useful to hitch a ride. all these high towers. Okay, Sly. Head up to the re-education tower. I suspect that's where we'll find the clockwork eyes. The door is locked from the inside. Try working your way around to the tower's window. There's more than just the clockwork eyes up here. Why are you doing this? Neela! She set me up. I'm an honest cop. Of course you are. I've read your psychological profile. I know that you're honest. Then why are you doing this to me? Because, dear, you're honest. You see, by chasing after Sly Cooper, you learned too much about the claw gang and its spice operation. It was only a matter of time before you figured out that I was a secret member. So, when Neela gave me a chance to put you in custody, I took it. Coward! You're a disgrace to Interpol! I'll make it my life's work to destroy you! Oh, I'm afraid your life, let alone your life's work, isn't going to last much longer. Once I integrate the clockwork eyes into this device, your life's work will be whatever I tell you. I won't be brainwashed that easily. Quite right. It won't be easy. Or painless. But I will reprogram your mind, and you will take the fall for me at Interpol. Now, just lay back and relax. Go to your happy place. And stay there forever. I don't think they've seen you. 
Take a few photos and get out of there! No. I've got to help Carmelita. She's in trouble here. There's nothing you can do now. Get the recon photos and come back to the safe house. I swear, we'll find a way to help her. Interesting. Inspector Fox is restrained in an old Iron Tech 250. Crude, but effective. The clockwork eyes! They seem to be routed through that control board. Get a shot of the console so I can decipher its make. Those are the Contessa's elite shadow guard. Tough is too sissy a word to describe those guys. That's... That's a mind shuffler. I didn't think they were real. It's made of equal parts science and black magic. Indestructible to conventional weapons. 